what is vectors? The concept of vectors. What is a vector? Vector is a quantity that has both magnitude and direction. That's uh, different with a scalar. Scalar just has the magnitude, there's no direction. That's the vector. Uh, vector is often uh, represented by an arrow or direct line segment like this. The length of the line segment is the magnitude and uh, put the arrow, that's the direction of the vector. Uh, we always uh, indicate a vector by a letter with an, an arrow above it. That's indicated our vector or A, B or X, Y. Put a, a arrow uh, on its top. Mm, that's uh, that's uh, represent a vector. Uh, we always uh, use the free, so-called free vector. That means uh, no matter where the vector located, uh, we just consider its length, its magnitude, or and uh, its direction. If two vector, if two vectors has the same length and same direction, we view them as the same vector. That is, two vectors are same. If the if they have same length or same magnitude and direction, no matter what, no matter where it where were they located? That means uh, it's depend independent of its uh, independent of its start point. That's the free vector. That that means we can move. We can move the vector to another place. Just keep the its magnitude and uh, its direction. That's free free vector. We use we use. Uh, we bounded the vector by two straight, uh, two vertical line. Uh, means that this is a magnitude or length of a vector. This means the magnitude of the vector or the length. If a vector has uh, has length one, we call this vector is a unit vector. Uh, 
recall this uh, vector v is a unit vector. If the vector has length 0, we call v is a 0 vector. Uh, uh, be note that the zero vector has an arbitrary direction. Zero vector has arbitrary direction. That means It, it can be assigned as any direction. Actually, a zero vector is just just a point. It's just a point. It it does not have have the length. It does not have length. So its direction is any any direction. And there's another concept that is the angle between two vectors. If we put two vectors, uh, we place the two vectors at the same start point, if this is B, and the angle is the angle, the angle should be less than pi, be bigger than zero. The angle between these two line segment is called the angle between these two vectors. Uh, we should note that the angle should be greater than zero, less than pi. We just uh, use this angle as the angle between these two vectors, but not this one. Not this one. We always uh, restricted the angle uh, less than pi. That's the angle between two vectors. And two vectors are called parallel. Parallel vector. If the angle equals zero or pi, that, that means these two vectors have the same direction. This is A, this is B, same direction or reverse direction. The same direction that has the angle uh, theta equals zero. They, if, if they are reverse direction, they has the angle pi. This angle should be the, um, the positive position. And uh, the, there is perpendicular vectors. If two vectors has the, has the angle theta equals pi over 2, that is 90 degree. We call these two vectors are perpendicular. Uh, we write as A as perpendicular to B. This says the parallel we should write as A as parallel to B. That's parallel. That's parallel. That's parallel. This is perpendicular. It's the basic concept of vectors. Then next, we should uh, talk about the, the operation of vectors.